Lan, if you can begin with an opening statement. Sure. Well, I would, I would just say that they don't come much, as from a coaching standpoint, they don't come much more fun than that. Like, when you're up 21 to 2 or whatever it was, it's, it's a little easier to, for, from my standpoint, to lower that stress level. And, uh, you know, I think from a player standpoint, you know, getting off to a great start was, I think, important because that team, you know, think about the travel that they had to get to Brookings and play a Friday night game. Come down here and play an early game on Sunday. I felt like it was, it was an intelligent team, but I felt like if we got off to get started, it would be a great sign because of the difference in the level of fatigue and the two teams would probably be able to You know, great, great team win. I mean, just a lot. Of, and I just said to, to Brad on the post game show that uh, I, did a, I did a poor job of scheduling from the standpoint that we played two and then we're off for nine days and then we play a lot. But, the great thing is, is we we're a deep team. We're really a deep team. I think that's that's really comforting uh, from my standpoint. And I think it's comforting from from a player's point of view because there's an understanding that that they can play from an effort standpoint at a certain level, um, and then come back, you know, the next time they get in and, and do the same. But they they're not going to have you know risk them to play all day. But most most players can't. And I think there's a there's a you know, our challenge is to, to get them to understand how many how many ways can you impact the game at the time that you're in there. Um, and, and it's not, in, in some cases it's about making shots, but in some cases it's about doing a lot of other things. Uh, you know, just a, a great team win that was a, on, on a short track. And, uh, you know, I hope there's a few more like that because that is a lot less stress than I normally feel in the game. <laughs> Questions for the players? Marissa, there aren't I mean, too many two-game stretches in your career where you've had 12 points and felt good about your performance. How do you feel after these two performances? I feel good. I think that, I mean, I don't necessarily need to score that many points because I can just pass it to literally anyone, and especially sit today. But literally anyone, I know that I can trust that they're going to make a shot or make a play or like anything. And I think that's really nice. That's like, that just says something about our team, like how deep we are. And, um, I mean, my team, she did it right away. I mean, it's just nice to know that you have those things, and they can't they can't guard that because you have to respect the drive. And we just have wide open. We had a lot of wide open shots, today, but that was our plan to use screens and go into the spots and we knew where their gaps were. So we did well. I guess uh, talk a little bit about that start, but uh, Jim said it related to stress levels. The player would have to your stress level. Um, yeah, definitely. I've been struggling with my shot lately, so it felt good to finally be making shots and just the good passes from my teammates and stuff really helped in the screens. And yeah, I was really thankful I could finally make something. Yes. How does it feel out there when you guys, like, you probably knew you had a deep team coming in, but to see these first two games go the way they have, and you guys have 49 assists on 59 baskets, which is just absurd. How much confidence do you have in one through twelve so far that anybody can get a shot if they're open? For me, I have a lot of confidence because, like, I'm not hitting my shots like I haven't been, and I know she's gonna or Audrey or whoever. Like, there's there's just so many people that you have to guard, and you just have to worry about so many people. Like, usually there's a player on a team where we're like, oh, maybe we can help off, or like, you can't really do that with us because the minute you help off, then they're gonna hit three or make a play. Like, and I think that gives us a lot of confidence going into games like Drake or Nebraska. Um, just gives us a lot of versatility. Especially with the amount of road games you guys have coming up in a row, I guess, how important is that confidence to build it up this weekend at home? Um, really important. Nine, or what is it? Six away games we have next? Four? Yeah, um, lots of Quite games. a few on the road. So really important that we got the two at home, build some confidence, and um, I think it helps with our trust in each other, too. Marissa, Jim's, Jim has struggled over the years to figure out are you a better point guard, are you better off the ball? I mean, at this point in your career, where do you see yourself being able to provide the things that you should I think that's like a game by game situation. And I think that it depends on, I mean, who they. Like, I, our starting lineup can always change, and I think that's kind of a variation, too. Um, I mean, I, I, 
care. <laughs> I just like being on the floor. I mean, I don't know, because I can do whatever, and usually like the ball, like the ball will just like end up end up in my hands a lot. So I'm fine making plays from point guard or the wing. I mean, I've been playing a lot of point guard as of late, just because in the starting lineup, I'm point guard like this But in practice, like Jade plays point guard and I'll play the wing or Olivia. I guess Tessa has a, been around this program a long time, seen a couple different, I guess, the way your teams have been structured versus what you guys can do. I guess how, from this, from your perspective, how deep is this group compared to others that you've played on? Um, I think I, the depth on this team is huge. Uh, I think everyone at this point feels comfortable going to the game and being able to contribute something. I think that's really big for just um, our all-together team confidence and how we step on the floor. Thanks for all the fun. Two more questions for the players. 